Have you ever considered how Super Tuesday can make or break a political campaign? This pivotal event in the American political landscape often serves as the turning point in the race to the White House. Take the recent Super Tuesday on March 5th, for instance. A total of 16 states and one territory held primary elections, with the political titans, President Joe Biden and former President Donald Trump, locking horns in a bid to secure significant delegate leads. Trump was the Goliath in the GOP contest, dominating against Nikki Haley. On the other side, Biden faced resistance in Michigan, but was generally expected to come out on top in most Democratic contests. Now here's a little trivia for you. Did you know that key states to watch during Super Tuesday include Alabama, Arkansas, California, Colorado, Iowa, Maine, Massachusetts, Minnesota, North Carolina, Oklahoma, Tennessee, Texas, and Utah? Quite a mouthful, isn't it? But let's dial back to the intriguing story of Nikki Haley. After a disappointing defeat in her home state of South Carolina, she vowed to continue the race. However, Super Tuesday had other plans, and the results led to her decision to end her White House bid. Talk about a plot twist. Interestingly, it's not just about the candidates. Voters, particularly suburban and black voters, play crucial roles in determining the outcomes. So, it's safe to say, Super Tuesday is a collective effort, a testament to the power of democracy. To summarize, Super Tuesday is a critical juncture in the race to the White House, with the recent event leading to significant victories for Biden and Trump and the unfortunate end of Nikki Haley's campaign. It's a day when voters wield their power, shaping the political landscape of America. And there you have it, folks. If you enjoyed this witty dissection of Super Tuesday, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more bite-sized breakdown news insightful content. Remember, every like is a thumbs up for democracy. Until next time, keep those political spirits high.